<laughs> Good morning, you guys. I am still like partially halfway getting ready, but I just wanted to hop on real quick and say good morning. I am feeling a little bit better after last night's little bit of a scare. You guys, I don't think like watching the footage back from what happened with me and my mom and sisters, I don't think I conveyed how scared and how serious the situation truly was for a little bit. Like, it got intense for a minute. So, still so grateful for awesome people. It was just a miracle. So grateful we made it home safe. In other news, I have been running around like a crazy person this morning, trying to get everything in order, trying to get the kids bathed, get them dressed, ready for the day, fed, get my house clean, everything that needs to be done because I will be getting a text or a phone call here very shortly and I will be having to run out of the house and go to a hospital like half hour away. So one of my best friends is having her sweet baby today, number three. She does not know the gender. She has two boys and she hasn't found out the gender of what this third baby is yet. So, so excited for her. She is having her baby today and she has asked me to come do photos and video of that once in a lifetime special opportunity. So I'm so honored and so grateful that she asked me to do that. So she could literally be calling me any minute saying, okay, Kenz, it's go time. We need you here now. So making sure that everything's in order, trying to make sure I have babysitters lined up for any time that I need to go, and it's just gonna be an awesome day. Hi, it's a boy. Hi. <laughs> Hi, cute dude. What in the world? You guys having a good day so far? Yeah. You look handsome. So, mommy doesn't know what time she's leaving. I could leave any minute. I could leave in a few hours. You can leave right now. Yeah. But we'll see. I don't know if you're gonna be with Shelby or Aubrey for a minute, or if you're just gonna be with Nana when she gets off work, or if you're just gonna be with Dad when he gets off work. We'll see. But I want you guys to be good, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I have been packing and preparing, which I told you guys, but I think the thing I'm most nervous about is leaving Cohen. I still exclusively breastfeed and that's just kind of nerve wracking to me. I don't know, I feel like he needs me, I can't be away from him. So I have actually been pumping this morning. So I have actually been pumping this morning. I got a lot saved up. So um, I did put some formula in here just in case he for some reason runs out of breast milk. Got his bottle, I've got sunscreen, I've got an extra outfit for him and Ken just in case. Diapers, wipes, the whole shebang. I don't know why I get so nervous when I have to leave my kids, like I do not like it at all <laughs> and I always feel like I have to prepare every single little thing which I know I don't and I know they're gonna be fine but it's just my mind I don't know why it works that way so still just waiting for the call you guys it is about noon and I haven't heard from her yet but we'll see I should be hearing from her very shortly up a little before you wanted to. Are you pretty girl? I love you. almost 4 p.m. and I still have not gotten the call to head to the hospital. Liz, I am sorry. <laughs> that does not sound fun. She has been in labor all day long, but hoping it is soon. Cody actually will be home in like an hour, so I'm kind of wondering if the kids will even need another sitter other than him. So we will see. We should know here pretty shortly, I'm guessing. It's been kind of a funky feel today though because I haven't really like let the boys go out and play with neighbor kids because I don't want to be searching for them when I'm trying to hurry and leave the house and I don't want them to get all messy and sweaty and I don't know. It's just kind of been a weird feeling day but I'm still so excited. I cannot wait to find out what you're having. I, I don't know. I just, I'm so excited for tonight. So that is the update. I have actually been working on... Hi sister. <laughs> what? It broke. It broke? 
Oh man. But I've actually been working on a camping check checklist. So I have like our supplies and then I am making my food and drinks list right now. Tomorrow is our last full day at home before we head up the canyon for the entire 4th of July weekend. I am so excited. We are going to have like four and a half full days of camping and it's gonna be a blast. So I'm trying to make a list. I'm going to start getting things like set aside, all like put together in one pile so that the car is easy to load up. I need to wash sleeping bags, set our tent up, get it all swept out. Obviously, I probably won't have time to do that today. So tomorrow will be more of the like camping prep day, but I'm excited, you guys. So many fun things happening today and this weekend. It's gonna be a blast. Thank you, big hair pupper. That is your shirt. Okay. Oh, thank you. She's being so cute helping me with the laundry. Right, you guys? I'm still home. I'm home too. It's 5.30 <laughs> in the p.m. and I'm still home. I haven't had to head to the hospital yet, which I'm kind of grateful for because I was nervous about having a bunch of different sitters. But now I'm like glad that Cody's home now so that I can just leave whenever they need me to leave. How was work, babe? It's good. Yeah. Miss you guys though. We missed you. He got a part to fix my dryer and I'm so stoked. New what? heating element. You want to play outside? <laughs> yeah, our dryer sinks, so hopefully it fixes yeah. it. Yeah, can't get hot, so placing the heating element, hopefully that'll fix it. Heck yeah. Oh, that is so beautiful. Cody's home. I'm safe to let the kids play outside because since someone is here to watch them, I can just jump in the car and leave when I need to. So I am letting the kids finally run around outside. They've been out here playing for like a half hour now. And then Kinley asked to have chalk. So they are coming with chalk. Is that so fun? Awesome. Okay. Ooh, that's a cool rainbow, Carceru. I love it, dude. That's awesome. Tiny, what are you coloring? Dad. Dad? You love your dad. He's pretty uh, awesome, mommy. huh? You love mommy? Mom and we love this, you guys. Mom and this is his hat that he's wearing sideways. Awesome. <laughs> Ooh, Coco, what is that? Pizza. Pizza? You're making your mom hungry. That looks good. Mine's down there. Yours is down there? Yeah. Awesome. I found pink. Oh, oh. You found pink. Yeah. And um, I just walked in to the entire front of my dryer right there. Don't know if that's a good sign or not. How's it going, babe? Good. Going good. <laughs> Love you. Love you. That's your item, Kenyon. You wanted to no, say, no, I love you. No, no, Dad. Dad. Do you? No, no. No, no. no. What, Sissy? Mommy. Are you coloring? I love mine. D. I love mine. Looks good. I love mine. you, Dad. <laughs> good job, buddy. And Coda is welcoming everyone into our house. And even Carson drew dad. What does it say? I am dad. I am dad. <laughs> I love it. That's mine. You love yours? Oh. oh, me too, sis. That's beautiful. I know Okay, what did you do, Carsey? I did all these stripes. That is super cool, yeah, bud. See, mm -hmm. Mom, check this one. Oh, nice. And it's on that side of the stairs, too. So cool. <laughs> That's a crazy boy. Wow. That's he cool. Got too. Looks like someone I know. I love mine. Oh, nope, Sissy, yeah, you don't color awesome. up there. You are pretty awesome, buddy. I love it. They definitely need to get hosed down when they're done. I love mine. <laughs> what? Oh, that is so beautiful, sis. Purple. Purple and pink. Nice. 
Where's the green one? Um, there. Grab it. Show me which one's green. <gasps> Good girl. Which one's yellow? Good girl! All right, I'm kind of just nervous cleaning now and I just vacuumed. But look who just woke up! That was a long nap, mister. Oh my gosh, I could just like squish you. I squish you. And I do all day. <laughs> all right, it's a sad day. Our tree that we've wanted to be our big shade tree has died. It's time to cut it down, huh, Coco? It's been a good tree, huh? Yeah. Kind of. It, it kind of died, but cutting it down. Timber! Yeah. Got it Fire down. You. Now we've got a little more room for our fort that we want to make. We're right on top of all those weeds. Yeah, pretty close to that, huh? Rest in peace, tree. We've got a lot of work to do here. Lots of rocks to be cleaned up, sticks to be moved, weeds to be flattened. Just gotta do a lot of work out here. Coco's gonna do it all, huh? You got it? I did it all, but I'll do some. <laughs> Good. It's a little overwhelming, just like how much work there is to be done back here. I just need a tractor, level everything out, dig a hole for our trampoline. We got lots of plans out here, so. Yep. Gotta get to it. Up and sweep. You're so nice. Done. Done. <laughs> no. no. It's dirty. Good sweep. <laughs> All right, you guys. It is now 8:30 p.m. and I'm still waiting for word to head over to the hospital. Last I heard was about 45 minutes ago, and she was just barely five centimeters, and just barely got her epidural. What, Sissy? Okay, one second. So she has had a long, long day of labor, but hopefully it'll be any time now. In the meantime, I have been setting aside all of our camping stuff over here, trying to get it all in one place, so that I can get it all cleaned and packed. I am washing sleeping bags because no one likes to sleep with musty smelling sleeping bags. So, got these washed, hanging to dry. These two are looking especially handsome. Hi! Yeah, boy! <laughs> but that's where we're at, you guys. Still no baby. And I think all they were waiting for was me to film that clip because right after I did, I got a text. They are ready for me, so I am out. Good luck with the kiddos. I got him, babe. Go have fun filming Daddy. some videos. Okay, Sissy, be good for dad, okay? How's the food, guys? Delicious. Delicious. Very high star meal here. Raviolis. <laughs> oh, man, Kinley. <laughs> you got a little bit on your face there. Is it yummy? <laughs> Stop. So I don't know if I ever gave an update on the dryer. Ran a wash, the load did not heat up again. So failed today. I'll have to go to a few different parts to see if I can fix that. I bummed out about it. I was excited to get the dryer up and running properly, but looks like it'll have to wait another week or so. All right, just put all the kids to bed. I'm about to go to bed. Kenzie's still out shooting her friend's birth. And guys, I am just so grateful for my amazing family. I love them so much and would do anything for them. They mean the world to me. I love you guys and I'm going to call it a day. But I love you guys. If you're not subscribed, please do. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. On the other hand, nope. Nope, that's not what I was saying. But the sun is so bright. Woo! <laughs> Ooh, you got yummy water? Did mommy put crystal light in it? Yeah. Um. She had, she had a lot to say to dad when he gets home. Hey, you know? Hey, Chris, honey, she doesn't need to be trying to stop right now.